I was at a hackathon that had mostly guys in it um, back home in the Philippines, and I met this girl who um, bonded with me over like our frustration over the gender gap, and I had told her about like the WeTech blog and what I had been doing, and she said, "Okay, why don't we like collaborate on something?" And I said, "Okay, if we create like events like this hackathon, but more centered towards inclusivity and technology, and like celebrating stories of women in tech." I have this dream that any Filipino youth can grow up and feel like tech is as welcome to them as just like any other person. And that when they think of somebody in the tech industry, it isn't like a set gender, race, or like socioeconomic like background. We also want to keep on bringing these second-hand laptops to different public schools. We want to keep reaching more students who have never heard of technology before. The overall goal is to be able to reach like every public high school that doesn't have tech equipment. We hear these really great stories of how tech is being used to connect people from around the world, to solve like world issues by giving and promoting tech accessibility. We're widening the ability for young people to be able to create their own solutions. We're hoping to give the resources that hopefully can enable future Filipino change makers to really thrive. That's what we think can not just help with like the development of the Philippines, but like the world as a whole. Because we acknowledge that in order to solve like really key world issues, like say like global hunger, like the water crisis, we need as many like diverse perspectives as possible. We're trying to equip those like marginalized communities and groups with like the resources they need to join those discussions about tech.